easy. Wait, honey, what are your options? Candy or a pen? I'm going to choose the candy. Do not choose the candy. Choose the pen now. Okay, fine. Honey, what are you drawing? I'm drawing a huge snowman. Breaking news. A huge snowman was found walking on the road. Yes, it worked. I knew it. What worked? Everything you draw comes true. Okay, I'm going to draw my dad because I don't know where he is. No, don't draw your dad. I never want to see that man again. Come with me. What is it, mom? Draw me younger. I want to look like a teenager. What? Just do it. Okay. Done. Oh my gosh, it worked. Okay, now, draw me a car, a big mansion, a hundred million, a huge swimming pool, lots of... Mom, I'm tired of drawing you things. I want to draw something for myself. Listen to me. If you don't draw what I say, you'll never see that pen again. If everything I draw comes true, then why hasn't my dad appeared yet? Come on, honey. It's your sister's turn. She has a whole list for you to draw. Mom, let me go. Who's that? Hopefully I'll get the colour of blood. That way I can be just like everyone else. Huh? Purple colour? I didn't even know purple existed. Honey, as far as I know, purple is the colour of animal blood. Animal? Yes, honey. You better change it to red. Okay, mom. I've changed it to red. Well, now you can go to school. Okay, mom. Take care, honey. Hi, guys. I'm new here. Oh, the colour of your blood is red? Yeah. Then you have to change class. Oh, why is that? The only people who can enter this class is the ones with blue blood. What? I should have changed my colour to blue instead. If I did, then I wouldn't be in this dirty class. Did you just say you changed your colour? Of course not. I'd like to order some food, please. Sorry, but if you have red blood, you can't order from this canteen. I can't? Nope, only people with blue blood can order. Actually, my colour was blue, but I changed it to red. Huh? Why did you change it? Isn't it good that you got blue? You didn't know. The king will end anyone with blue blood because he doesn't want anyone to replace him. End them? Yes. Sir, I want to ask you something. What do you want to ask? Is there any other class besides blue and red? There is one class, yes, but no one's ever entered it. It's for one person with a different colored blood. Why hasn't anyone entered? Because that person hasn't showed up yet. Why do I suddenly have a headache? Do you want me to take you to the nurse? Yes, please. My head really hurts. Why isn't there any nurses here? The nurses barely show up for people with red blood. I feel like I'm about to have a nosebleed. Excuse me. Oh my gosh, my nose is actually bleeding. Amara, open the door. Don't enter. Sir is sick. He needs to throw up. Hurry up. If she doesn't open the door, just break it. Yes, sir. I'll do it now. No, wait. Oh my gosh, Amara, you're purple, so you faked your color? I'm sorry, sir. Why didn't you tell me from the beginning that your color of blood is purple? Purple means that you are... It means that you're a special person who has special powers. Special powers? What are my powers? I don't feel like I have any. That's because they only work when you're angry. Angry? Yes, only people with purple blood has that How power. How do you know all of this? Hey, try to make me angry. Ouch! Did it work? No, I can't get angry at you. You're my best friend. You have to use your strength within 24 hours. Why? If you don't, you'll never meet your real parents. Real parents? So my parents right now aren't my real parents? No, they're not, because they don't have purple blood. They have red blood. Amara, I'm so scared. They said people with blue blood will get killed by the king because he doesn't want anyone replacing him. You'll be fine, don't worry. There's something I want to tell you. What do you want to tell me? If you want to know, come with me. What is it? Actually, the color of my blood is the same as yours. It's purple, but I'm trying to hide it from people. Does that mean you're my brother? Yes, you're actually my sister, and I came to the school on purpose to see you. Amara, there's no point trying to look for your real parents. They're gone. Gone? What do you mean, sir? Everyone's been looking everywhere for them, but they weren't found. Where's my brother? I need to tell him something about our parents. Is this his phone? So he's the reason they disappeared? Why are you holding my phone? You're the one who made the parents disappear! Yes, it was me. They've always loved you more than me. They've spent their whole lives looking for you, so I intentionally made them disappear. You'll never see them again. Why do I suddenly feel so angry? Hey Amara, good to see you back. Thank you, you too. Hey mom. 
Did you get a new haircut? You look so much younger now. Aw, thanks. Mommy, I really want that ice cream. Sorry, honey, I didn't bring any change with me. Hey, no worries, I can get it for her. Are you sure? Yeah, of course. Well, thank you very much. You're so kind. Hey, watch it. <gasps> I'm so sorry. I wasn't looking. <sighs> hey, can I please have another cup of coffee? I accidentally spilled mine. Sorry, I can't serve you. You have more than 20 downvotes. What? It was an accident. Get out. Otherwise, I'll call the police. <sighs> What's happening? Amara, you're all over the news. What? Why? You have to take a look at this. Girls, today you will choose your husband, who you will slay to. This is ridiculous. Hey, so who are you choosing? None. I'm not letting any man control me. Stop being silly. Everyone has to choose. I already know who I'm picking. Good for you. But this whole thing is wrong and no one's saying anything about it. Hey, pick me. No. I hope the girl that chooses me has a nice body and long hair. Is that all you care about? No, but it's what I prefer. Sis, have you picked? I'm so scared for my day to come. I don't want to pick. Then don't. No one can force you to do anything. I wish that's how things work, but don't. I've had enough of this. Time to change history. No one. I don't want to pick him. Sis, my first tooth fell out. Aww, you're growing up so fast. Don't forget to put it under your pillow so the tooth fairy can come and give you some money. Okay. Thank God she's asleep. Okay, let's do this. Wait, where's the tooth? Morning. Did you remember to put your tooth on the pillow last night? Yes, I did, and I saw the tooth fairy. You did? I mean, of course you did. Mom, did you put money on the Lily's pillow last night? No, I thought you did. This is so strange. What's on the news today? It has been reported that another six-year-old child has been found dead with all of our teeth pulled out. Before her death, she had seen the tooth fairy. Lily! See, I told you the tooth fairy was Lily? real. Back away, that's not the tooth fairy. See, I told you the tooth fairy was real. Lily, that's not the tooth fairy. Officer, I've already told you everything. Okay, can you describe what this tooth fairy looks like? No, she was wearing a black mask. Okay, you're lucky you were able to stop her. Just rest for tonight. We'll look into this further. But what if she comes back for Lily? I don't think she will come back. You almost caught her, so it'll be too risky. Don't worry, you'll be safe. We're just one phone call away. Sis? <sighs> Lily, I already told you. Go to bed. I want to see the tooth fairy again. Are you insane? She was trying to hurt you. No, I want to be with her. Hey, Lily, I'm sorry. I... Wait, where is she? I guessed it. Of course, I'm never going to be anyone special. Hey, what are you guys doing? Sorry, but from now, we can't be friends again. Yeah, we don't want to be friends with you. Why not? Because you're an ordinary person. I'm the child of a company owner. We're not on the same level. And I'm a mafia kid. Class, today we'll be doing history. Please make sure only special students are in this class. But sir, where do ordinary people go? You need to go to the ordinary people class. Oh, look who we have here. I knew you'd end up working as a waitress. Can I take you guys' order? Amara, there's someone who wants to order tea. Please deliver it to table Why A. Why not you? Because he said he wanted you to deliver Me? it. Me? Yes, hurry up. Here's your tea, sir. Thank you. At the request of the prince, I'm here to invite you to the palace. Why me? Because the prince said you're his childhood friend and he wants to meet you. What? Wait, why is my status loading? Each color has its own discount. I wonder what color I'm gonna get. Three, two, one. You got purple. Purple? How much is the purple discount? As far as I know, purple's not on the discount list. I got blue and my discount is 70%. I got pink and my discount is 80%. I just bought an iPhone 16. I got purple. There's no purple color on the discount list. Her discount is probably 0%. She can't buy anything. Ew, right? Why is everyone buying expensive things? Because there will be a competition tomorrow. The one with the most expensive items win. Everyone buys things with their own discount, so today you're going to have to stop buying things. But I don't know how much my discount is. How am I supposed to buy things? 
I guess I'm just going to have to try and see. It's bad if you don't go to school tomorrow because you don't have any discounts. So you won't be able to buy anything. Don't worry. As soon as my discount appears, I'll straight away go and buy something. Buy something? If you get 0% discount, what can you buy? Flip-flops? <laughs> no way. My discount is on 100%. I'll be nice. What? I can't wear this to school. I'm going to get kicked out. I'm so going to get him back for this. Uh, honey, why are you wearing a bathing suit to don't school? Don't even ask. My soulmate made me wear it. Are you sure they'll let you in with that? I don't know, but I have a really important test today and I can't miss it. What is she wearing? Amara, you look hot. Shut up. Can you stop taking pictures of me? Amara, report to the principal's office immediately. You're home early. Yeah, I got sent home. And I missed my test because of my stupid soulmate. Payback time. You're wearing something normal today. Yeah, and I finally got my revenge. Did you guys hear? Some guy got hit by a car this morning, and he was wearing a My Little Pony onesie. Hey, Amara, how many lives did you get? I got one. At least now you can just be honest with everyone. Yeah, that's not always a good thing. Hey, Amara, do you still have that top I borrowed you? Oh, you know, I've been looking for it for over a month now, and I still haven't found it. Are you lying? No. Well, now you got zero lies. I know it's at yours. I saw it when I was there last weekend. <laughs> you got me. Amara, have you done your homework? Can I quickly copy it? No, I literally forgot. Come on, you always do it. No, it's true. She wasted her last lie on me. All right, I'll copy off Sarah. Hey, you. I heard you kissed my boyfriend. What? No, I would never do that to you. You're my friend. Well, he said he saw you do it. He's probably just trying to spit you guys up. And besides, I don't have any more lies, so there would be no way I could lie to you. Oh, yeah, you're right. Hey, you excited for tomorrow? What's tomorrow? Our lies are going public. Oh, sh. Heard? Heard what? If you have 4.5 and above, you can enter a competition. And what's the prize? No one knows that yet. I have to get my rating up. Hey, I got you a little present for your birthday. Oh, you remembered. Thank you. Hey, do you need help? Yes, please. There you go. Don't worry, Mum. I'll make the dinner tonight. Thank you so much. I've had such a long day today. I'm so close. Why do you look so upset? I didn't do my homework. Hey, have mine. Really? Thank you. Amara, where's your homework? Sorry, miss. I forgot it. Not good enough. I qualify. And the winner of the competition is... Amara, come up to the stage. Here's your prize. Bye, Mom. I'm going to school. Wait. Before you go, can you give this to your teacher? What is it? Um, it's just a note I wrote to him. Okay. Okay. Amara. Hey. What's that note you're carrying? Oh, uh, it's just a note my mom told me to give to the teacher. What does it say? I don't know. I'm not allowed to read it. Okay, class, you're free to go home now. Hey, this is from my mom. What is it? Um, nothing. Remember the note I told you about? Can you read it for me, please? Yeah, sure. What does it say? It says, I don't... What do you think you're oh, doing? I... I was just checking when Sarah's birthday party is, so I don't forget to buy her present. Oh, okay. Um, by the way, I'm leaving late tonight. Okay. Well. Have fun. I'm not doing it. But I'm closest to the money. Hey. So what number are you on? 99. Oh, that means you're getting the money. So what's the task? I don't know. I haven't gotten one yet. That's strange. Anyway, um, what task are you on? I'm only on 70. I still have a long way to go. What's wrong? Nothing. I need to go to the bathroom. What does this even mean? No, I refuse. Hey Amara, I lied. I'm actually on level 99. I'm sorry about what I'm about to do, but I really need the money. Hello? I have a case for you. I'll be right there. You'll be looking into a missing girl's case. She's been missing for 20 years. Okay, yeah. No problem. I really hope I'm going to up. Hello? 
Hi, um, I'll be the PI looking into your case. Oh, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Can I come in? Yeah, of course. So, how old would your daughter be now? 22. And her birthday? May 1st. Oh, that's mine too. How old was she when she went missing? She was only two. May I see a picture of her? I know she was really young, but anything helps. Yeah, here. Um, why do you have a picture of me? Here you go. Um, why do you have a picture of me? It's not you, it's your twin sister. Her name is Bella. This has to be a joke. I don't have a twin sister. Yes, you do. You have to believe me. I'm leaving. Please don't go. We're your parents. No, you're not. Please pick up. Please pick up. Hello? Mom? What's going on? Please tell me I'm not adopted. Did she just hang up on me? I need to do some research about this. My whole life's been a lie. You came back. You have five minutes to tell me the truth. Come on in. You were kidnapped when you were only two years old. Someone took you from us. Why black? I don't even know how I have a black lipstick, but let's go. That's for the black lipstick. Hey, whoa, what's up with the black lipstick? What's up with the wedding dress? My soulmate made me. Same. Hey guys, sorry about the pink shoes. My soulmate made me wear it. It's just a coincidence. Hey, Amara, I'm gonna have to speak to you after class. Amara, I'm gonna have to speak to you after class. Okay, everyone's free to go home now. Hey, Jenny, can you walk out with me? Wasn't Sarah gonna speak to you? I don't wanna talk to him. Why not? Because I think he's going to tell me he's my soulmate. What? Isn't he married? I don't know. Hey, you wanted to speak to me? Yeah, I wanted to tell you Wait, that. Wait, before you say anything. I just wanted you to know that I'm not into you like that. And I'm pretty sure it's illegal. What are you talking about? What are you talking about? I was going to say I think you're my son's soulmate. It doesn't make sense. Why are you wearing the pink shoes then? Because I wanted to support him. He was feeling very insecure in them. Oh. Sorry about that. Yeah, he told me to look for a girl wearing black lipstick. He's your son? Yeah, do you want to see a picture of him? Sure. He told me to look for a girl wearing black lipstick. He's your son? Yeah, want to see a picture of him? Sure. Damn, that's your son? Yeah. He kind of looks like a criminal. Uh, what? I'm just joking. Is it because of the black no, lipstick? No, not all. Black looks good on him. See you later. Jenny, guess what? My soulmate's super hot and he has this like edgy look to him. Wasn't your soulmate our teacher? No. It's his son. Okay, this is weird. And I'm going to meet him today. You should be careful. Be careful for what? You've never met the guy. You don't know how he could be like. Amara, have you seen the news? It's about a guy wearing see? black lipstick. <laughs> Have you seen the news? It's about a guy wearing black lipstick. Let me see. What? What happened? I think that was my soulmate. No way. This guy's a criminal. I don't know what to do. He told me to meet him at the park alone. Don't go. He might try to hurt you. Yeah, but like why alone? You know what? I'm gonna go. He's my soulmate. He's not gonna hurt me. I can't believe I'm doing this. Wait, that's him. Why is there so many people wearing black lipstick? This is weird. Hey? Oh, hi. You're my soulmate, right? What's going on? We want you to join our group. Group? What do you guys like? Rock places or something? That's one of the things. You in? I'm not doing this. Get rid of her. Please just listen to them. Trust me. Wear this. I'm not doing this. Get rid of her. Please just listen to them, trust me. Wear this. Now we're talking. I don't get it. Why do I have to wear black? No reason. We just think it looks cool. Okay. What now? There's a VIP event happening tonight. It's going to be full of multimillionaires. Your task is to distract them. While your soulmate takes care of the rest. What's he going to do? You'll see. Now hurry up, you're going to be late. Please don't tell me we're actually going to do this. Shh, listen. 
I couldn't speak much because they were around us. But I have a plan. I've been trying to leave the group for a while now. And I'm so happy I found you because you're going to help What are we going to do? We're going to trick them into believing we actually completed the task. So, do we have a deal? Deal. I knew you wouldn't disappoint. That's interesting. And what happened to dad again? I met him before I moved here. He wasn't ready to be a dad, sorry. It's fine. Don't feel bad, it's not your fault. Hey, who are you controlling today? My dad. Whoa. Crazy, right? I've never met him before. Um, I don't know, beard, I guess? Hmm. Let's go with yellow. Go home. I don't get it. You want to come to my house? My mom's making yeah, dinner. Yeah, sure, why not? Dad, you're back early. Did you shave your beard? You look different. Amara, meet my dad. He came back from business. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. I'll be back. I need to change from this yellow top. It's been bothering me all day. Amara, meet my dad. He just came back from a business trip. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. I'll be back. I'm going to change from this yellow top. It's been bothering me all day. Dinner's ready. Oh, finally. Let's go eat. The food is so good. Thank you. I hope you enjoy it. <coughs> Excuse me for a second. Hey, um, thanks again for the dinner, but I have to go. What? Why? Um, my mom just sent me a text. She says she needs me, so... See you tomorrow. Hey, you're back early. I'm gonna ask you again, and I want you to tell me the truth this time. What happened to that? I already told you, he wasn't ready to be a father. And you want me to believe that? Well, guess what? I was just eating dinner with him. And, oh... I found out I have a sister, which also happens to be my best friend. Wait, please. I'll explain everything. Wait, I can explain everything. Save it. Hey. What? Did you come here to apologize? Because if you did, you might as well leave. Please, I wasn't lying to you. Okay, maybe I did lie. But I lied for your own good. For me? Stop trying to control my life acting like you know everything. Only I know what's good for me or not. Your dad was dangerous. That's why I left him. And why should I believe you? You've been lying to me my entire life. You don't understand. You know I... That's it. I'm going to go sleep at that. You'll regret this. We'll see. Thanks again for letting me sleep over. Of course. Anytime. I've never asked you how your parents met. They met at the hospital. My dad was a patient there for a while. Was he sick? No, but he had drinking problems. So he needed a new level. I need to tell you something. It might sound crazy, but I need you to hear me out. I need to tell you something. It might sound crazy, but I need you to hear me out. I think we're sisters. Well, half-sisters. We have the same dad. What? No, that's impossible. Dad's never been with anyone else. I know it might be hard for you to believe me, but... I mean, you said it yourself. Your dad had drinking problems. He probably forgot he even had another child. Then why don't you just ask him? I don't know. Maybe he wanted to forget about me or doesn't want anything to do with me. Well, you have to ask him. That's the only way you'll know for sure. I don't know. I don't think that's the best idea. Yes, it is. Come. Dad, Amara wants to ask you something. Everything okay? I... I can't do this. What's wrong with you? Why didn't you ask him? I don't want to ruin your family. You guys seem so happy together. I mean, imagine you cheated on your mom. We're pretty much the same age. Look, how sure are you that he might be your dad? Pretty sure. Then what are you waiting for? Let's go. I wonder what my strength is. Mom, I'm going to school. Honey, what power did you get? Every time I cry, it rains. Okay, then cry now. It's been two months without rain. I can't just cry like that, Mom. You're such a useless child. Why is it so hot today? Just cry and make it rainy. Mom, you think it's that easy for me to cry? No, but it hasn't rained in over two months. Babe, I brought this for you from the canteen. Oh, just put it on my table. Okay, um, did you need anything else? No, just leave me alone. As you wish. Why did he speak to me like that? Honey, me and your dad are going on a cruise tonight. No matter what you do, make sure you don't cry, just for tonight. Sure. Hey, babe. Sorry, but we have to break up. What? Why? <sighs> How can you break up with me? We've been together for three years. Sis, why are you crying? Did you forget mom and dad are on that cruise? Calm down. It's just rain. They'll be fine. Relax. It's just rain. They'll be fine. 
Breaking news. A cruise ship sunk tonight as the storm keeps getting worse. A cruise sunk? The cruise ship was traveling from Dover to Spain. I hope it's not the cruise my parents are on. Sis, do you remember when mom and dad's destination was on that cruise? I don't know. Why? Because there was a cruise that sunk. What did I say? This is all your fault. <laughs> Wait! Mom would normally have called by now. I'm starting to get worried. <sighs> just stop crying. Can you just shut up? You think I'm crying on purpose? Kids, school event cancelled because of heavy rain. This is all my fault. Can you just stop crying? <sighs> you don't even know what I'm going through. Yeah, and no one cares what you're going through. Mom, come on, pick up. Just accept it. Mom and dad are gone. Mom's calling. I knew it. Hello? Hello? How come you have my mom's phone and who are you? Hello? Hello? How come you have my mom's phone and who are you? We need your help. Your mom and dad aren't doing well right now. They can't talk. What do you mean? What happened? We barely survived. We had to swim three hours for the nearest island. What island is it? Hello? No, don't hang up. How am I supposed to find them now? Who was that? My parents are still alive, but they're stuck on some island and I don't know where. Listen to me. You have to stop crying, okay? That's the only way you can help them out. I can't just stop crying. I'm stressed out. Just calm down. Everything's going to be fine. Just think of a good memory. Maybe it will help. It worked. It's sunny. Okay, now let's go find your parents. How are we going to do this? They called you, right? We can take the phone to the police and they can locate where the call came from. Okay. So, did you find them? Yes, they're not very far away. Get the rescue boats ready. We need to get them out as soon as possible. They must be dehydrated. Mom, Dad! We're so happy to see you, honey. Here, have some water. Wait, so you're not mad at me for crying? I mean, you could have chosen another day to cry, but no, we're not mad at you. We're alive, and that's what's important. Why didn't your sister come with you? We had a fight. She blamed me for what happened. Hey, don't be mad at her. She probably just did it because she was stressed out. I'll talk to her. Sis, I'm sorry. I shouldn't have blamed you. It wasn't your fault. No, it's fine. Thanks for the apology. How are you? I see you're finally happy. Yeah, I realized that I shouldn't waste my tears on someone that never cared about me. I deserve better. That's so true. I'm glad you finally realized that.